What's up, Rollies? It's the Benz fam back with another video. Today, we out here. It's kind of cold. We in our hers and hers. You know, these ain't like my favorite pick, but they're so comfortable. Shout out to my cousin Jordan. He be putting me on my comfort game because Jordans, I just can't do Jordans no more. They hurt my feet. So, yeah, we there now. Yeah. So, today, we want to take y'all in the store with us and we don't want to make light of this or we're not like out here being reckless or none of that but we have to go to the store so i don't know if y'all can feel like the vibe in the store mm -hmm. it's like it's eerie. so different it just feels it's so like, weird and it's like you're trying to stay away from everybody you don't speak to nobody nobody speaks to you people put their head down when you walk past like yeah it's crazy um she don't really get the social distancing because she'll like pull up on a whole like crowd of people i do not no she does y'all no i don't she does so I, like she'll turn people around and go down me she'll and go down an aisle like, they'll be like that people are pulling up on me there'll be like five people in an aisle and then here comes the sixth <laughs> shut up i stop like, doing damn, that damn baby so don't go down the crowded aisle before i start i'm gonna let y'all know that we have gloves and we have more than one pair of gloves yeah, so if they you come in see me with gloves on in the store and then you see me later doing another activity like feeding my child or cooking or anything that she would have gloves on for at another time you gotta know to put two and two or one in one whatever level you own together to understand that that ain't the same glove okay and don't they come in like a box of a hundred they come in, there's a big ass box of the gloves there are endless gloves we got hella hella gloves so People aren't reusing these gloves. These gloves are going in the trash. They're not even going in our home trash. These gloves are being thrown away in whatever trash at whatever store we are leaving. So please know that. Uh oh, they're coming for us. Run, 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 run. Is that the police or the ambulance? Oh, that's the ambulance. Oh, Jesus, don't so we say gotta that. gotta pray for whoever they're going to yeah. get. Comment down below if y'all have been to the store. Do y'all feel like the shift, the, the vibe switch? Do y'all feel that? It's just, it's real. It's a real vibe and it's kind of weird. And it's weird because I would think that like I would look forward to going to the store because it's some of the only, it is the only place that we go. So I would think that I'd like look forward to it. Like, okay, well at least we get to get out of the house. <clears throat> but it's not, it's scary. It's scary to go to the store. And because we are really taking our quarantine seriously, we are not going anywhere at all except to the store and pharmacy like absolute necessities um the My only arm place the Why only you place so much? Up, Here, the only this. place the only place that we would come in contact with the virus would be at the grocery but store but we don't so even say scary. shit like that that's kind of scary so we don't even say so like we that. get in we we get out we do our grocery shopping once a week this is the only time that we accidentally forgot some stuff and had to come again cuz we've only been going once a week like strict Put everything on a list, go get it at one time, get in, get out, get on. All right, before we go in here, let's have a moment of truth. Are y'all staying in the house or not? Nah? Which one of y'all is like, nah, I'm not really staying in the house. I'll be doing this, I'll be doing that. If you don't stay in the house, where do you go? Because there ain't nowhere to go, so I want to know where you go. <laughs> yeah, going. like where are you going? I know some people, when they get told to stay in, they can't stay in, so they find somewhere to go. Is you going to the homie house? Is you going to the studio? You going to get food? You going to the store? You going to make a drop? What you doing? Where you at? Where you going? Why you not staying at home? I hate to say that you're not taking it seriously, but how serious are some of y'all taking it? On a level one to five, how serious are you taking it? I'd say we're taking it like a five. I think we're taking it a five. Even when we go in here, we won't touch our phones. I'm gonna leave my gloves off for now. I'm not gonna touch anything because I gotta touch the camera. So it wouldn't really make sense. So know? I gotta touch everything. And I feel like some people think that we overreact and then we think that some people are uh, underreacting. So let's have a conversation about it. Do you feel like wearing gloves in the store is doing too much? Do you feel like wearing a mask is doing too much? I personally don't. I don't have a mask, so I'm not wearing one, but actually I, I do. One. I do have some, but, but we're going to save it in case you really need it. We ain't like tripped out or nothing. We're just being cautious. You yeah, know? you can't be too cautious. I don't feel like so I'm going in though. Let go. So you come in and they got the sanitized parts up here, which is cool. This is a different store than what we usually go to. We don't usually go to this store, but it's a nice store. Yeah, it is. All right, what's the list? What's up with this hair? 
So this store is like a little more of a bougie little store. So it's probably not gonna be hit like the normal stores will be hit, but we're gonna find out. See, when you come to the store with someone and they're doing that, it just makes you want to walk off like you didn't come here with them. Cause then they're like, oh, she's she's with her. And I'm like, nah, I'm not, I ain't even with her. But I swear you don't got to cough until you get in the store. So I'm looking for like actual wings, but it looks like all they got is these drumsticks. House be empty. But this, this store has a good amount of stuff, huh? Yeah, this store's well stocked and well priced no, and not well priced. Well stocked Damn, and not well priced. Ketchup. Why this ketchup? Eight ninety nine. There's two of them. Oh, I was gonna say. But yeah, sometimes baby wears the gloves and she touches all the stuff that we're gonna take home a lot, and then I don't say anything. But I'm gonna just say that to y'all, not to her. <laughs> like she, she touched all over the ketchup with her gloves. And she, she has a cough too. You have cough too, boy. Oh, you a snitch, are ya? <laughs> I feel like a reporter because I just keep asking y'all questions, but on some real shit. How are you feeling about the quarantine, man? I just really want to know, like, because I'm feeling so many kind of ways. Like, I, I feel like, yeah, like, <laughs> like, I like it in a sense. Kind of like, yeah, I kind of like it too. Like, it's cool, it's, it's chill, nice you get to be with your family, but I wish it was warm. Like, if we was in Cali or Belize, I would be quarantining for real with my hot babe. My beach, babe. We was kissing the other night and then baby gonna stop and talk about some, uh, you know this ain't social distancing. <laughs> I'm like, you watching too much coronavirus news to be telling your wife that while we try to get in the mood. So we, we got this little addiction going on lately where we just stay up late and watch all the numbers and news about coronavirus. So I'm curious how many of y'all are just binging on coronavirus news. We ran out of news the other night to watch, remember? We did. We did. Crazy. And I'm going to be back with more questions. Get so, I figured out what it is that she does that I, I just can't stand it in this kind of conditions in the store. She stops by people. So people will be walking, she'll just stop right here by them like this. I'm going to get this gun and when she does that I'm going to shoot her see me look look somebody start coming I start running I gotta go I gotta go get your wife and go see how to get to safety you know what I found out today y'all I found out that oh look she's running now good girl good girl good girl wife good wife today I found out that my dad has never made a deposit into an ATM. What did he say <laughs> about putting money in a box? <laughs> what did he say? You, so you want me to just put your money in a machine? <laughs> Is it gonna give me some kind of receipt or something? And then he called me from the ATM trying to figure out how to do it. I was like, all right, dad, you old school. He went to the bank to go pay his bill today. I didn't even know my dad was old school like that. But it's funny because He's old enough to stand in the line to shop early. You know how they let elderly shop early, which I think is a very cool idea. I love that. But uh, he's old enough to stand in that line, but I feel like people would be looking at him like, why are you in this line, nigga? Get your young ass out the line. That might be a good problem to have. This store just is, it's still the vibe is weird, but I need to take you to like Smith's, y'all. So if you want to see a part two with Smith's when we go for our real shopping, Hashtag part two and we gonna show you but uh, you know, we ain't been to Walmart Walmart just sounds like a bad idea You see what they're talking about to stay vigilant. It's also important to stay calm and to stay informed Here are some pointers to reduce your chance of exposure cover your coughs and sneezes with your arm or a tissue Keep your hands away from your face Clean countertops and other services. Most importantly, talking to me. Y'all get her. Get her. They're talking to you. Okay, I think I need to go like around that. Why? You know, make it be creative. Be creative. That doesn't look like you're making a good decision right now. It doesn't. It doesn't look like the decision's good. Good job, baby. Good job. See? Look. Good job. Keep it moving, sunshine. I can't let her go to the store alone. Can't do it. She just be out here just risking all kind of germs and shit. See? Yeah. 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 Yeah
Ocasio. She just took me past that crowd and I could smell all of their fragrances, which means I'm too close. To do? Take a quick, swift right into a lane. Like, what am I supposed to do? See, don't go out with unexperienced shoppers when you do this, like her, because they put you in danger, girl. Yeah, this store is way different, huh? It's actually better and more expensive, so I guess. Deli counter shut down. Ain't no deli counter. So I guess at the bougie store you can get whatever you want. They got everything for a high, high price. So be ready to drop bread. Go to the bougie store. They got almost everything. Maybe not. Ain't no fish. None of that. No butcher. No deli. She's serious about her shopping now that I said she was unexperienced. She's trying to get on the move. Huh, baby? She can't get no eclair, huh? Oh, my son wants some apple pies. God damn, why they $1.79 a piece? Oh, damn. What to do? We're going to watch her bend over, y'all. Huh? A go ahead. Go. Philadelphia cream cheese is really better than the other one. Hell yeah, what y'all think? I think so too. Ooh, gotta run. What? Uh, what else? Gotta run, I gotta run, gotta run, 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 gotta run, gotta run. See, there's people. You gotta go. When they come, you gotta go. When they come, you gotta go. Oh, he's a cute old man. He's probably better for us to get the hell away from him. What's y'all Corona snack? What is it? See, I was gonna go down the aisle, but you know. I'm gonna just keep staying in my lane. But I'm gonna just keep going. Staying in my lane. Running around here in circles. But what's y'all snack of choice? Like, what are y'all eating? There's still no toilet paper. Still no tissue. And you know it ain't gonna be no Clorox wipes. So we not even gonna go, go down that aisle. I feel like chips and salsa, so I'm gonna get some. And ha do y'all like mango salsa? Cause I love mango salsa, but I can't find it. Danger zone, she's still gonna go in it. See, she was. Had I not said it, we would have been in there, cram. <clears throat> she was going over there. Those eyelashes. Mm. What do you know, honey bun? She's my honey bun lately because I've been eating a lot of honey buns lately. Girl, I don't even know about honey buns. Yeah, I don't want those. You don't like Juanitas? Um, they're all right. This jerky's on sale. For normal price, it's five nineteen. It was five ninety nine. What a big sale! See, she's getting in the danger zone right now. Right now, danger, danger, danger. See, I dead ass go the opposite direction when people start coming in my aisle. I just don't. And I see how to tell baby to get going. Go, go. Hit the gate. Hit the gate. Hit the gate. She caught it. She did it. Proud of her. Very proud of my wife. Now it's time we get up out this joint. Now I lost my wife's Your job. So proud of you. You're on your way to going to the store loan soon. <laughs> then we come I home to this little buff. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> Watch out. Be careful. Mama's. Those look so cute. Huh? Be yeah. Like you came from the 80s. <laughs> yeah. When? Look at her with her hand on her hip. When was you doing that? Huh? Okay, so when we come in the house, we take off our sweatshirts, we Lysol, we wash our hands very, very well. I like to do it with extremely hot water. No shoes allowed in the house. Make and if sure. y'all wondering about my baby's hair, it's because we got into a little argument this morning where she had one braid in and then she wouldn't let me do the other one. Make sure you subscribe, join the family if you have not become Ben's fam. And like this video and all the videos that you watch, please. Let's get up to 500 likes and 
Turn your notifications on so you can see every time we post. What do you want, Cece? Chichi? <laughs> Say please. <laughs> no, okay.